Okay guys, we're back. It's been a couple weeks. Um, I had some PSATs to do and stuff like that. And, a and quite a few tests. Um, my dog's in the background, so if you hear something, it might be her. I don't know. But so, we made it to Cerulean City um, with our Nidoran male. Uh, I leveled it up a bit, and I'm close to evolving, so I want to get that on screen. I'm just going to do some quick uh, leveling up. Uh, I caught a Spiro and a Pikachu, so we'll look at the Pokedex entries in just a moment. Let's first get our Nidoran to evolve. Okay, we're close. So Nidoran male and Nidoran, Nidoran female both evolve at level 16 into Nidorino and Nidorina, respectively. Ooh, he's gonna go for Quirky Deck, is Let's switch out to Venusaur. Nice. Okay. And we'll heal up. Yep, okay. So now that we're around near evolving, we're going to go over here, so, uh, what's that? Grass and here. Okay, yeah, so this is the bike shop. So we're going to head inside. Remember, we were here. Now that we have our bike voucher, we can talk to this man. Oh, that's a bike voucher. Okay, here you go. And we get a bicycle. So apparently, that little thing for listening to that poker, f uh, the president of the poker fan club or whatever, we got a one million poker dollar thing, or worth a million poker dollars. We can use this way. Out of this house, down around there, over here. Oh, okay. This is the daycare right here. Basically, what you do is you. I'm a daycare. Would you like to raise one of your Pokemon? Yeah. So what you do is you choose a Pokemon to deposit, and he raises it for you. Every step you take is one experience, as I said. Um, and you pay a hundred dollar uh, fee up front. Well, once you get it back, um, as like a starting fee, and then an extra hundred per level that it grows. So, let's say I want to put in. Well, probably not Paris because that's my um, HM slave. Why don't we put in Pikachu or something, you know? Because Spiro I'll have later, and you'll see why. So I'll put Pikachu away. Yeah, he could be helpful for, like, status, like Thunder Wave, but I mean, I'd really just use Venusaur as Poison Powder. Um, okay, so, you know, we can go for, uh, let's see, what is it? Ah, Pokedex entries for Spiro. Okay, tiny bird Pokemon eats bugs in grassy areas. It has to flap its short wings at high speed to stay airborne. Again, guys, I'm sorry. I don't know why it keeps saying rope battery. I'm not trying to save anything or whatever. So I don't know why it says that. Uh, when several of these Pokemon gather, their electricity could build and cause lightning storms. This is a mouse Pokemon. Okay. Uh, the rivals in the anime. Okay, let's go in here. Okay. So I'm sure you guys have heard of all the news, all the hype, about all board the hype. Ooh, we got a guy here. The hype train. That is all the people who are excited. Ooh, we're about to evolve. Hype Train, which is all that is all the people who are excited for Pokemon Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire. I'm personally getting Alpha Sapphire. No, you're kidding. 160 Pokemon. What? Nidoran Male is evolving? Crank up the volume. <laughs> Nidoran evolved into Nidorino. Yay. 
I guess let's just continue. I think we have a battle here. Yep. Okay. Are you good? He's got a Butterfree. That looks pretty nice. Oh, freaking sleep powder. Look how big Nidorino takes up on the screen. It's ridiculous. Uh, let's just switch into Venusaur for a body slam. Take that out. Okay. Uh, Pokemon Center. Heal up. There we go. Okay. So another a way that you can go in SSM and do everything and get cut and whatever and be able to go back on there because they basically they don't let you go back because they say the ship has set sail. Um, but one way that you can get on there is what you do is basically you have to hold on. Okay, so you get your cut HM whatever you do whatever you want to do. But you make sure that you have at least one uh, trainer or whatever that um, that you're fighting, or at least one that's a bit difficult, and you let them make you faint, and then you you're at the P uh, Pokemon Center, and you don't have to uh, leave. You technically didn't leave the ship, so it never set sail. Mm -hmm. So that's the one way to do it. There's other ways that we'll go on. We'll talk about it in the future. So, if we go out this way, I'm not going to fight any of these guys yet. I'll probably save them for the Mew glitch. Basically, if we go this way, hold on. If we go this way... Sorry, I'm, oh man, sorry, I was a little quiet. Okay, so this is an engineer, he's a Magnemite, an electric type Pokemon. Okay, so we just took him out. Even though that wasn't very effective. Oh wait, yes, sorry. I don't know what I'm thinking. Thinking in the future. I shouldn't be doing that. Magneton. Come on. Come on, so close. Yes! Okay. Nice. $900. It's quite a lot of I don't think it's anything down here, but I do know this. You go up here. Oh man. Oh, there's a drowsy. Um Okay, we'll just take them out. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so right here is a escape rope, yeah. As I thought. I was I wasn't sure if it was an ether and escape rope. I always get the two mixed up. Well, especially when it's the one from Mount Moon. Um, we're also gonna fight this guy. For oh, haha, I have lost. Um, we're gonna switch Pokemon Venusaur. Just go for a body slam. Body slam, okay. So, we can talk to this guard. Catch lots of Pokemon. It's hard to think of the names. In Lavender Town, there's a man who rates Pokemon nicknames. He'll help you rename them too. We can go upstairs. I don't think we've been able to do this before. If we look through here, look into the binoculars. The only way to get from Cerulean City to Lavender Town is by way of Rock Tunnel. Or to Lavender, whatever. Over here, we talk to this guy. Hi, remember me? I'm Professor Oak's aide. If you caught 30 kinds of Pokemon, I'm supposed to give you an item finder. So, Edan, have you caught at least 30 kinds of Pokemon? No, we haven't. Um, an item finder is basically the dowsing machine, although it works so much worse. It basically just says if there's a hidden item on the screen. I'm looking for Nidorino. Want to trade one for Nidorina? Um, yeah, about that, I kind of would just to get the Nidorina, or the Nidorina, and I'm not, I don't have anything against using the Nidorina, but I mean, I don't know. Um, I'm going to roll a dice. How about that? Because I don't mind having a Nidorino. And, I, okay, well, actually, I feel kind of bad doing that. You know what? No, I'll just, I'll keep mine. I'm sorry, dude. No, I just, I just feel bad giving away a Pokemon. Like, you know? Look in the binoculars. A big Pokemon is asleep on the road. That's where we're going right now. Just to go check him out. 
Okay, so we go this way. Um, I do believe there's a hyper potion in this one. I'm just checking the other things first. Yep, okay. See, I know. <laughs> For some reason, I just know all of that stuff. Okay, so let's go talk. Let's see what this is. A sleeping Pokemon blocks away. This Pokemon looks pretty big. Can't, can't move. Man, okay. So Lavender Town is apparently up that way. Cerulean is like over diagonally. So let's go back. Ooh, I didn't want to go on the grass. Spiro. Um. Okay, there we go. Let's try and get back. If we can. Ooh. I know the bottom route is pretty safe, except for this last guy. There's that guy back there, and then this guy over here. But you can easily just do that. Okay. Um, let's go to the Pokemon Center before we leave. Oops. Okay. So now we have cut and everything, right? Okay, so now we need to go to the gym. Uh, okay. Pokemon. Paris cut. Paris activated with cut. So this is the Vermilion City Pokemon Gym. Leader Lieutenant Surge, the Lightning American. So we're gonna head inside. Talk to this man. Yo, champ in the making. Lieutenant Surge has a nickname. People refer to him as the Lightning American. He's an expert on electric Pokemon. Birds and water Pokemon are at risk. Beware of paralysis too. Lieutenant Surge is very cautious. You'll have to break a code to get to him. Vermilion City Pokemon Gym Leader, Lieutenant Surge. Winning trainers. Green. That green. Okay. Um before we go in there, let me see if I can teach Dig to my Nidorino. Uh no, I have to evolve it, which I'm not going to do. Not yet at least. Um plus it will make this a bit harder. Still really easy if you have Venusaur. So basically what you do is this works like hidden items. There is a hidden item. Okay, let's fight these guys. Basically, there's a hidden item in one of those trash cans. And you have to... Hold on. Okay. Basically, it works like this, a little like this. There's a hidden item in one of the trash cans. There is also another hidden item. So once you find the first one, the second hidden item is in one of the adjacent, I do believe, um, just these four, not the corners, um, uh, trash cans. And that's how the game works. So because we talked to this guy, he says, that's their setup, double locks, here's a hint. When you open the first lock, the second lock is right next to it. Yeah. Um, I'm actually going to leave just to get my uh, Nidorino back up. Because I don't have any potions with me for some reason. Why don't I get this from the P uh, PC? Oh, wait, no, I think I did pick up one, maybe. Maybe I'm thinking of something else. Did I pick up one? Not the Hyper Potion. Okay. Did not. Okay. So we're going to go over here. Um, deposit the Hyper Stone, or the Hyper Potion. Um, we're gonna move the bicycle up to the top. Okay. Uh, you can move that with the select key. Or on this emulator, Virtual Boy Advance, it's the delete key. Uh, let's see. We don't need that. No, 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 no. Um, wait. Yeah, okay. No, 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 no. Where are my potions? Huh, I guess I don't have any. I'll buy some of them real quick. Um, where is Pokemon? Somewhere over here. Here we go. Man, okay. Buy some... Man, it doesn't even have any normal potions. Okay. For this, I'll buy, like, three super potions. There we go. Okay. 
Um, Pokemon Paris Cut. Okay. So let's look for some locks. There's a switch under the trash. We turn it on. Okay. So now that means that there's one adjacent one. Let's try this one. Nope, it's on the trash here. So now, if you get it wrong, they reset, which means that it's completely somewhere else. Or somewhere completely else. Um, I don't think it matters which switch you do first, whether it's the second or the first. Or maybe there's only one and then the second one comes in after you find the first one. Um, I'm not really sure about that. Basically, by doing this puzzle, you unlock the gates up there. Ugh, why don't we move up? There we go. Nope, okay. No. 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 Okay, let's fight him. Let's go with electricity, he said. Okay, let's take him out. Dynamite, let's take that out. Go. Take out Voltorb again. Nice. Hmm. Where would the lock be? I wonder. Here's one. Let's try this one. Nope, they reset. Okay. Let's fight this guy up top. Lieutenant Surge, whatever. Okay, send out a Pikachu. Ooh. Come on. Come on. Oh, man. Took it out. Okay, Venusaur just got a body slam. Woo, he's dead. Okay. So, you know what? We'll continue this next episode. Um, Pokemon Red. Whoops. The house is pretty stupid. Okay. We will continue this next episode. Bye.